was uh, where the, the, the that those where those windows are there. That's there was a bench there for a man, and he stood there, and, and he, and I had to have his soil and stuff cut and okay. uh, ready for him to mold okay. the castings. And uh, see, we made the castings. It was the the big furnace room, uh, the uh, the where the boil, boiler went up. Okay. I, that was uh, I had to have that fired every day. I think we're going to show you that room today. Oh. Well, it's down the hall. It's the one I'm thinking of. Yeah. And so you say, the, where did they bring in the train? Used to stop up here, right? Right out in front of these windows. Uh, well, along these windows here, okay. and we'd unshovel that and 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 loaded it down into the building here, and then we'd take it up a an elevator okay. to to the second floor to the cupola, uh, to the yeah the okay. boiler part. And that was the coal. And that was the coal that we burnt burnt to melt the iron and. With so many shovels of, of coal. Uh, and how much coal did you shovel a day? A carload, did you say? A carload a day uh, would come in. Wow. Yeah. That's amazing. Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah. No wonder you're in good shape. <laughs> now, there used to be tracks, railroad tracks under this floor. Do you remember that? That's right. And what, was, what did you use those for? Uh, the railroad tracks uh, came from Geneva and they... And they brought the in there, and the, here's where they built the the engines uh, was down on this upstairs in the engine room. These went just to Geneva. Those <laughs> those traveled, you oh. know, came from Aurora down or someplace, okay. you know. I see. Okay. Look at this. Were you ever up in the office area? <laughs> No, <laughs> the officers I don't know too much about. How about this? I've seen them. Yeah, this is this is the way our foundry looked when you come in. <laughs> but we didn't have the lumber. <laughs> okay. In the, in the, and they had these runners like this, and that was run off a belt. There was a a line overhead I see. that come down and run all these here. Was this this room then that we're in? Well, it was it was a big. This was a big room. It didn't have this wall in. This was part of right. it. Right. This was part of, it. and this. <laughs> Yeah, this is this is where they were assembling different parts of that engine. See, okay. and see those those belts were run by the waterfall. Really? Yeah. The, those belts the dam right? out here. Yeah. There was a dam right right there, and that that would that would run the water. Uh, and that, that. It was a turbine then. Yeah. And we had we had lots of work to we had lots of work to do to 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 get a, it ready for 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 the foundry because I mean uh, the engine room then then the, these parts all went up to the engine room <laughs> and they assembled there. And that was my job to, one of my jobs is to, to wheel that up in a, in a steel cart and uh, he to unload them for so many of these kinds, so many of that kind in different areas. Okay. And when you say engines, that you made engines, what type of engines? The small engines? The, the little oh. gasoline so the engine. Stroke? Okay. Yeah. This was a room, and and you would probably have a, a, a bench along that side, and guys could work there. When I was here, 
The... The... Art Anderson, if I remember right, that was his name. He was a, a big sweet, and he was in charge of hiring, and he's the guy that hired me when I was working for my my uncle. And he, uh, and, and he was, uh, my uncle didn't need me anymore. Yeah, it was getting nicer weather. It, it was in the greenhouse, and uh, so, uh, and that's how he hired me and, and put me in the foundry unloading the coal. That was the first job, and then it, I went up and I fired the cupolas uh, to heat the iron and mill that iron every day so, so we could pour the castings. Very good. What year did you begin working here? Do you remember? <coughs> it would be... Well, I, I could find out. <laughs> Dad, were you married to Mom when you worked here? Well, I was later, but I don't remember no, exactly. before you got married. When you got married, I can't were you still remember. working for Uncle? No, I don't think so. I, uh, I wasn't working, on, working for Uncle because I laid off. Yeah, see, I, I remember, remember kind of, of that kind of stuff, you know, hanging on the walls and, and, and where somebody was working or the guys were working and stuff like that on, on the whole foundry. So too. that was some sort of a drill press then? Yeah. yeah people would just have that? You can make it a little bit farther. <laughs> and that, lo that looked like the stairs that I used to have to walk up to go and take a shower. <laughs> oh, really? They had showers here? <laughs> we had showers upstairs for the guys that worked in the foundry. Very good. This is now a closet, but if you notice the railroad tracks on the bottom, are you saying these tracks used to go to Geneva? Dad? Right by your feet? Dad, there? right here. Yeah. No, down here. These are the railroad tracks. Are these the ones that went to Geneva? Well, this they is... They went through the building. This might well, have been yeah. Yeah, it probably was on the... On the the, the dam side of the building. Right. It went. Uh, it went to Geneva, uh, here, uh, to just to take the stuff, and, and that's where they load on the railroad. See, okay. this would remind me of of wh what what the tracks looked like that went up to Geneva to load on. These were rails. They they went all the way to Geneva. Out, out, the, out there, and went up to the, the building, and 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 uh, went on the side. They had these tracks that went up right alongside the what, what it might be tracks out there now. I don't. Well, there's railroad tracks out there, but they're not this wide. No, no. These will look like like push cart tracks or something. Yeah, this is the uh, this is what we had push carts, that's how we moved all the iron and everything in the, in the coal and the between coal. In the building. Or in the, the building, yeah. in the building, wow. yeah. Well, we have some original um, advertisements from when uh, uh, they were in their glory, Challenge Industries. Yeah. Okay, and we've got some other pictures in this other room that are of the actual factory. Oh and yeah, it might bring back some memories. I don't know. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. Well, this is this well, those big old that that that's the engines we used to see. Yeah. Sitting around at the windmill tower and stuff yeah. there. When did you work here? I I worked here in. I think it was uh, 38, Yeah. Yeah. Maybe 40. Were they still doing advertising like that in? Oh, or oh, yeah, we were advertising. Wow. Well, I want to show you some other pictures that might look more yeah. familiar. Yeah, that's right, because I, I worked there for uh, 
Well, until uh, <laughs> I quit, but I just can't remember, but I... When you went to the Navy. Well, there, probably when you went to the Yeah, Navy. that's yeah. right. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. So, uh, so these go back a long time, but I think they go back even longer than your time. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. This, this oh, is. yes. Oh, yeah, they were old. Uh, yeah. The challenge I, I heard, you know, different now when we we used to have this and and uh, and like I said uh, we we had uh, those stairs that, that went there and we used to go up to our shower room I see and okay. <laughs> but it was it was neat Not, they weren't as, as neat they were just <laughs> plainer but that was the kind of a stair and we and it was about like that high uh -huh. that uh, every night after we got done working, we we could take a shower. I, I got to tell you, the pictures we're going to show you now look like you guys needed a shower. <laughs> oh, we course. did. I, come you, on, just follow us. If you, can. you, you should. So we'll go along these railroad tracks. <laughs> You've seen uh, the and the you know, black. One of the things that we love was that beautiful view of the river when we got to, yeah. you know, when we moved well, in here. Oh, oh well, yeah, the river, uh, the ri river was uh, always a, a, a admiring and people who used to come down, but. They still well, do. Yeah. They still do, and we, f we have fish. Todd and I and Todd's sons, my grandsons, yeah. they're 11 and 12, we fished right off the dam here. Right in so the did I. Did you really? <laughs> I sure so did. We haven't put them all up yet, but this is what this, this thing looked like. That's what it looked like when I was here, see? Wow. Uh, yeah. Isn't that something? Yeah, this was fun. These guys, they most of them, Seeing standing, and they had to stand up from the time they came to work till they went home. This one has railroad tracks in it. Yeah. See the tracks? The the tracks. Yeah. Yeah. The, 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 yeah. yeah. And, the, and I have one other, and we're going to kind of make a gallery out of this. Yeah. Do you think you might be in one of these pictures? <laughs> Let's well, see. Let me spot I, you I, here. I, huh? I certainly could be. <laughs> I, 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 I could be yeah, I supplying stuff, but it's too, too, too many, uh, you know, yeah, uh, so many years now. But, the interesting uh, part is where these tracks end. Let me show you. Well, they, uh, they are. Well, they were. The, these the, were the ones that went to Geneva, Dad. These were. Probably these are the ones that we we used to push the. The, the cart. metal carts, yeah. uh, big metal carts through, and and push the castings from yeah. one room to the other to to finish. Uh, see, the, they just did so much on one right. part, and then, and then it like went on to the next room. Maybe an assembly line. Well, yeah, well, or the assembly line. Finally, let me show you where they end. You'll get a kick out of this. <laughs> okay. They end right here, see? And oh. we figured out that the reason that they ended is because of look at the room where they emptied the stuff. All this stone, what is it, about two feet thick or something? Yes. This, oh, yes, this I was know. Some kind of a, I, it was like a furnace room or something. And here was the, the flute, you know to make it come out. So look at this room. Oh, oh, well, this is, uh, this is the way you, 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 you would say in this, where it come out, and this is how they used to, this used to be something like this that you opened up to, up to so. let the iron out yeah. Yeah. after I had it melted, yeah. the cupola. Yeah, we, now we put this in. Yeah. We told the owner, we asked him if we could um, put something in there, not a plant or something. And we said, you got any old stuff we can put in there? And he says, I got stuff. 
<laughs> and he takes my sife, my yeah. son and I down into the bowels of this thing, and we're yeah. walking through a, a, oh, a, yeah. a little corridor, you bend your head, he yes. opens up a big, I don't know if it was a metal door, Todd, or what, yeah. and he has stuff. Yeah. And this thing was all rusted and beat up yeah. and everything. Yeah. So, what, what's that? What's it that? Look, it looks like... Did it I get it? I'll clean it, that up. It reminded me, when I saw this, of, of what you had to open up. Yeah. And that iron run down, and, and the guys would stand down with their ladles and catch that iron uh -huh. as they come down the iron and yeah. pour, pour these molds that the guys made. See, we got our water, and we run into, so, uh, and, uh, and it was fed in, in uh, you know, to each division where you could, for drinking, for the guys work, and you walk yeah. over. That, this was, and, and we, uh, and this looked just like what we, when we got the iron melted, we could, a, a guy, that's his job was to open that up and and fill the kettle and push it down the 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 yeah. runways. Okay. To, well, now I understand why they have the showers on the premises because if you look at these. Pictures, oh yeah, that's how these you guys were. Weren't fit to go home. You, in that you, oh, you, you <laughs> should have seen the guys. Everybody was black. Yeah. It was like a coal mine. Well, Gene yeah. said that they had to sandblast this room because it was it, there was so much soot and everything in here that everything they had cleaned it all off. Oh, oh, so I can cool. imagine. Yeah. I can imagine that that because it was so dirty, we never, we just worked in the dirt. And I yeah. would think it must have gotten pretty hot in here because these Oh, wood, God, it was hot. Well, these wood uh, yeah, all lengths yeah. are all burned back. Yeah. You know, so you can see where they, they kind of... The only thing we up. don't understand about this room, and maybe nobody ever will, is what in the world are these two things? It's like they chained things to them. Oh, you Maybe mean the two different color brick? No, 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 the, no, no. the, the, the hooks, hooks here. Hooks these, uh, there. Can you hooks, see these them eyelets. there? Oh. Can you see those hooks? Oh, oh. This, this thing right here. That, I mean, that's in there. They could have been, they, they could have been, a, a, you know, a, a bench or anything like a hook to them where the guys had to stand up and work on them. But if yeah. this was, Dad, if this was a place where they had a lot of heat, well, uh, see, I can't. Uh, I I never worked in, in the the part that, that I worked in <laughs> almost every part of the foundry. But I mean, uh, I never. I don't recall what was what individually. Yeah. Well, there, Gene is the fellow that uh, runs the place. He's the owner. Oh, yeah. And um, how long have you been here, Gene? Oh. More years you want to count? Yeah, or? <laughs> yeah, over 40 years, 50 years. Yeah, yeah. We'll yeah. see. Like I have. But he's the one who fixed this place up that makes it look like it's yeah. today. Oh, it's well, this was, this was pretty rough limestone buildings. <laughs> That's what this whole, whole challenge was right. built out of. The saving grace is that the buildings are built on bedrock. Yeah. So it's, no, it's, not, going it's not going anywhere. It's been here you for a hundred years. Dad, that, that, I'm going to guess that was an opening there. Oh. A big door opening. And I think it looks like this on the other side. Right. Yeah. Yeah. We'll show you. And there's rails here. Everything the, leads here. Oh, it, it could have been. Well, this opening over here where the pipe is, years ago used to be a uh, quarter inch steel raceway to tie it into the old chimney that's still outside. Uh -huh. so that's that's that, so that was the old the chimney, chimney. This right. is what I said. Right. That that right. reminded me of, of it as soon as I saw it. The chimney's still here. Even though it w was <laughs> dirty and black. and but <laughs> He was in here in the 19, late 1930s. Right. He was. Yeah. 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 And this was something that Gene covered up. 
beam comes this up. Right. This opens up to the but other side. Oh. There's rails underneath this that come oh, in. Oh, they came in here. Yeah, like those other rails. Oh, yeah, that see, oh. that was the rails that I had rails that I had to push up. And then, then we would have a, a, a place to put, uh, run, uh, run, those, uh, run those rails in there, and then we'd take the, uh, the castings and stuff up like the machine shop, yeah. so they would uh, sort them out and put... Uh, and I have a question for you. You coming in here, when was the last time you were in this building? Oh. Probably 40 years ago. <laughs> Probably 1940. I don't think you've been in it since you left, since you went to the Navy. So I don't think I was years. ever in the building since I... Yeah. Six, Has seven, it changed at all? Pardon? Has it changed at all? Oh, yes. Uh, uh, the, <laughs> yeah, yeah, everything has changed. <laughs> uh, I mean, it's all together. I, I can't believe that... that, that you never, there was no nice desks or nice chairs or, or nothing, any place in the place. You didn't have a computer station working for yourself? <laughs> Not a computer. What? <laughs> uh, who, who was she, huh? <laughs> yeah, there you go. George, those tracks that came through our closet. Yeah. Those are the tracks. Yeah. And, uh, those are the cl closet we used to pile a, uh, and, and push the carts, a metal cart. Okay. And that was, uh, they were on the... And was this the other end of the furnace here? Was this part of the furnace? I think it might have been. Oh, uh, the carts, they, they were manufactured here. I imagine uh, someplace in the engine room or someplace. But, uh, Really, I can't. I can't help you out t too much on where they they were built, but they were built in here, and, and that's what they were used for. That's what he said. This is. This would be the smelling part. Would be where, like like I showed you, where we worked up on the top and fired the coal into the boilers and melted uh, uh, and uh, opened up and they opened up the, that one reminded me of it. Right. Yeah. Where that uh, valve was. Yeah. That was the chimney flue. And uh, oh, that the, was on the, the side of this wall here. Hot, hot iron would run out into a, a big kettle that the guys had plastered up with plaster inside and then wheel it down the runway on a, on a track uh, overhead. The carts were, 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 were big and I'd push them. One man could push them. You only got one man. You, you, worked, you worked when you worked. <laughs> um, this used to be the main offices for Challenge Windmill back in the 1800s or the 1900s. And access to this was actually above ground. There was a walkway that ran from this building across the alley to the uh, River Street building. And that, there was a concrete sidewalk on the roof and it went through and then back out to the street because at that time, this was mostly foundry and the, there were two sets of railroad tracks. So the railroad used to run between the buildings and so for access here, uh, and to keep uh, a nice office with a view of the river, everything else, the executives up here didn't have to walk across the tracks. And uh, that's all been removed. But uh, this basically is original. We're doing some rehab on it. Stripped all the old oak, but uh, one of these days we'll finish this off. Um, but when Challenge was in business and a previous companies since or after that, um, this has not been used for office probably for 50 years at least. One of the other things of interest here is the old built-in safe. It's an old D-bolt back from turn of the century, turn of the 20th century. 
there was one, there was an adjoining building next door here, and that had a safe in it also. So it was multi-levels. It was all concrete for three levels, three stories. And uh, very unique. This is a building where... <clears throat> This is the north building where the mill race powered, uh, where the water power powered all the machinery in the first and second floors here. And the, tail, the, mill, the mill was run through uh, water power from the head race going out the tail race and through where a parking lot is now to a previous building, which that building was machine shops for steel, and this was all wood shops for crating and framing for the original windmill towers. The towers uh, east of the Mississippi apparently were primarily wood, and everything west of the Mississippi was made out of steel. So they made everything here from castings, for gear cases for the windmills, for piping, plumbing, anything to do for, for um, products for farmers horse troughs, and you name it, just a little bit of everything, but primarily really plumbing products tied in with the windmills. 